All right, so doing a short segment here uh, for the rest of my viewers um, on how to get the rust off of your quad. Um, thanks to Honda, I have a full steel frame, steel A-arms, steel bumpers. I mean, most of the stock metal on here is steel uh, as far as framing goes and such. Uh, so as you can see, I've got some rust right here because steel is so easily rusted and uh, my short segment here is just going to show you uh, how to take that off. You're going to need steel wool and WD-40 and a, uh, a cloth uh, I think is pretty necessary but a lot of people don't use them. Uh, it's just kind of your opinion or whether it's available to you or not. So I'll go grab that stuff and hang on just a sec. All right, sorry to keep you waiting, guys. Uh, so as you can see, got my WD-40 here. I've got steel wool, and I've got a rag for cleaning it up when I'm all done. So first things first. Sorry for the bumpiness there. First things first. Just gotta lightly spray down the spot with WD-40. Count to about 10. Then what you're going to do is you're going to take the steel wool and just lightly rub back and forth all the way around the whole spot. Make sure not to rub off too much of the powder coating around it or rub on anything else around it. And just get in there and make sure that get all the rust off and all that crap off and then you can see there's some residue here uh, that's from the WD-40 from the steel wool and some of it's actually the, uh, the steel here that just come off um, so once you clean that up uh, you can see that a lot of that stuff is gone there's some down here yeah um, but that's kind of hard to get to. I don't really get to it too much. But, you know, you can clean up some basic spots that have gotten bad over time uh, with that simple method. So that's kind of the easy way to do it. And uh, once again, all you need, steel wool, a cloth, and some WD-40. Uh, I don't know how well imitation brand WD-40 would be on this, but I like to go with the real stuff. And, uh, you know, you can do this all throughout your entire frame. You know, some people's boots rub this stuff off and it goes rusty. You know, sometimes you get it down in areas around, you know, just because you didn't clean them or, you know, maybe they just rusted regardless of whether you could control that or not. So that just about cleans up all your rust spots pretty easily. Um, if you want to do a more permanent fix on that, I would suggest that you have it powder coated. Uh, either to match the rest or if if you want to while you're at it you might as well just powder coat it something cool you know you could do a black or you know any color I like to stick to the stock color I haven't powder coated it yet I'll probably stick to the stock cutter color because I have everything here that kind of matches with it you know from the exhaust to the uh, nerf bars down here you know it kind of matches with the frame and if it was black it would kind of contrast and I think it'd add too many colors to the quad. So, you know, I like to keep my colors simple there. So, uh, yeah, that's how to remove rust from your uh, steel frame or, you know, maybe even from other things. And uh, tune in next time for more things like this.